Right, so we've had to basically, well, we've been kicked out the house for a bit. To be exact, two and a half hours. We've got the house on the market now. We put it on, it went live on Monday. And on Tuesday, it went live Monday at four o'clock. And by Tuesday, there was 10 viewings booked in it. By Wednesday, there was 15 booked in. Uh, I don't think people realize, because we, we're working nights as well, we're getting up early and it's like, when we're coming in to go to bed at seven, after seven, eight o'clock in the morning, we're getting woke up to say another viewing's been put on. And it's it's been a killer. Uh, so we've been kicked out and we're taking the dog for a walk. Why? The estate agent showing him around the house. So the, I'd say the biggest problem we've got is it's that literally going out to work, then coming back home, then getting a text or a phone call, an email saying there's got a viewing. I'm trying to work out when you're working nights what times you're available because we do three on, three off, four on, three off. So trying to work it out on that and try and get some sleep as well and then go to work for seven o'clock at night. It's been uh, a bit of a ball ache. Well, it probably got a bit dark in here now. So once the house is sold, it's... Uh, Game into some other stuff then. Um, it's going to be very, very hard for Jan more so because she's letting go of a family home, to be honest. There's a lot of things we've got to get rid of, a lot of things. Totally downsizing. Right, so a bit of an update of where we're up to now. We've been unindated with people wanting to view the property so as you know the property's up for sale we put it up on it went live on monday at four o'clock by tuesday morning we had was it 10 no wednesday oh no no tuesday tuesday yeah, yeah tuesday. tuesday we had how many uh, 10 10 viewings by wednesday not the viewings, but they've been booked in. By Wednesday, we had 15 people wanting to view the property. So... We've put a stop on it. We had to put a stop. Because with us doing nights, and coming off nights, we're getting phone calls in the morning, so it's breaking up our sleep pattern. We have told them that obviously don't phone us before a certain time, but... The viewings are pinging through on the email. Ping, 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 ping. <laughs> so, we had to put a stop on it that way. So we had four viewings on, what day was that? Yesterday. What day? Thursday. Yeah, four viewings on Thursday. And two of them put an offer in straight away. A little bit more than what we was expecting. Not a lot, but... It'll it's come, a yeah, it's a bonus. Now, what we've done is, we've told the estate agents if they can look at the process, what they're in at their moment in time, if they sold or if they got cash buyers. Now we've got one where they've sold, subject to contracts exchanging and we've got one which is basically just put the house on the market now we've got another how many viewings tomorrow five six six, six viewings tomorrow so with the six viewings tomorrow then if there's any more offers on that we'll work it from there then but we have to all the estate agents make sure we, we want not a quick sale but we do want to not too quick yeah we don't want it to be lagging on for months on end like seven eight months um, we're hoping to be out of here for what october october november november at the latest 
Well, the beginning of November. Because we're on holiday at the end of November. Yes, because we're going to... Tenerife. Tenerife. Again. So, hopefully, everything, fingers crossed, everything will, runs to plan. They're going to let us know what the offers have come in. Once the offers have come in, then obviously we've got to decide... Who we accept. Who we accept. And it won't be because of like other appearance or they've got this or they've got that. It's basically who can. Well, it's where they are. Yeah, where, chain, where they are yeah. in their chain. We don't really want somebody's got to sell to sell to sell to buy. We want it so it's they can move on as quick as we can move on. So if that one sells, that gentleman's house is sold. When is it? Has he got the money to pay for this one has he got a mortgage in place for it um we will find out tomorrow when the other six come if they put offers in and hopefully it's not about getting any more money than what we've, we've been it's offered it's the position where they are yeah, at it's the position their sale jan's been uh even though the van's brand new the lodge should say is brand new <laughs> jan's Refurnishing it. <laughs> refurnishing it even though you've seen in the, vi in the previous video that the van comes with everything a feminine touch to it put it that way so, so it don't look like a caravan it doesn't look like a caravan it's, it's a lodge it's but... the curtains and stuff you've got to put your own touch to it so women who is watching this will understand what I mean blokes they just live in it women don't They've got to have their personal touch. So I've had to dance. I've had to downsize, and I'm going to show you something. Downsize what? My desk. <laughs> <laughs> so I'm going to show you <laughs> my downsized desk. What I've got for my YouTube. So I've downsized my desk. <laughs> <laughs> so I've not got my big desk anymore. I've downsized, which is good for me. So no that, well, that's that's me downsize. Cause I hate clutter. Right, so now it's a matter of we've worked, we've we've done our research on it. We've both gone through everything, making sure it's the right thing. What we're going to do on where mm. we've, so we've been through this. Yeah, but way. yeah. So we've basically looked at <laughs> fucking <Benny now. laughs> cut. So we've downsized, we're, we're, sorry, we're downsizing everything what we've got, clothes wise, we've come up with an idea because obviously the van's not going to have all the wardrobes but it has, it's just that we have got a lot of clothes and things like that, haven't we? Mm. Hats, gloves, glasses with me, uh, handbags, shoes and coats with you in it. Not coats, I have got no. coats but... So what we're going to do is, Jan's come up with the idea, and your idea is? Well, to have a summer wardrobe, once the summer's gone, pack it away, in the vacuum bags, in a suitcase, under bed, winter wardrobe comes out. So therefore, you're not getting rid of everything, are you? Because I do like my clothes. So what I'm going to do, because obviously uh, shoes are... I don't think I can downsize. <laughs> I need to downsize myself, but... <laughs> right. So shoes-wise, we don't want shoes in wardrobes and things like that, so I've come up with a little idea, which obviously as the video pro progresses and we get to move in the van and we add in everything to it, you'll see my storage solution for shoes and... Other little bits and bobs, mm, isn't it? I don't know. But the decking earlier, we've both... It's going to be amazing. Yeah, we've both come up with the idea. I've had one idea, Jan's had another idea. We've put them both together and it's come up with a, a really good idea, mm. hasn't it? It's really nice. Yeah. Um, I can't wait for that. Yeah. Because you're going to see... You'll see. I'll, I'll, I'll put a picture up now and a similar design of what it is. No! Keep it a secret. No, let them see. No. Because it'll probably be a bit different anyway. Well, I'll say no. Right. <laughs> well, if I don't put it up now, it's because yeah, Jan won't let Yeah, but what you can me. do is, you could do a before photo, 
yeah. they're showing the after photo. If you're going to show them what it is, they're going to get an idea, aren't they? So yeah. if you, yeah, well, you, yeah, you yeah, save I'll do it that. for a surprise. So it's not going to be up there. That could be another YouTube video, can't it, eh? <laughs> so, now, this, it's ready to move in. It'll be ready to move in. They're still doing the land now, aren't they? They're still oh, putting the... Cold, yeah. really? We're going to be homeless. Yeah. <laughs> so we could be living in a 2 by 2 tent. So... No, I'm not. You might be, but I'm not. I'll be in a B and B somewhere. So as soon as this sells, we we we've been looking at having an air conditioning unit put in the van. But we've been put off by that. Yeah, we've we? been told don't because of the expense of it. Expensive. Not for, yeah, it's, we'll it's expensive see. for the machine, but we'll it's see. expensive to run. If it's too hot, then we'll bloody have one. I don't care what it costs. So. So. <laughs> It's gonna be hard to be cold. It's gonna be it's gonna be hard. it's gonna be very very hard for us moving from here. More so for Jan because it's set a lot of sense. We can do like um YouTube like the first month. Do you yeah. know like the first year we could make it. Um, yeah, after the first year. So like people after we've moved in, if they think about doing it, we can like we've had some yeah. advice. Yeah, we, we've had yeah we've had quite we a bit of advice of people were. Or you can just laugh at us. Yeah, yeah, you can <laughs> laugh at us. But the driveway, we was on about just having a square coming out, and we've been advised to have it on an angle. It's like you're talking, that's dog barking, excuse that, cut. Right, so basically, the driveway, we've been advised not to have it square on, have it on an angle, so it's easy to get the car up the driveway. We've got... It's reversing there, isn't yeah, it? Yeah, it's block driveway, we're having put in, block paved in it. And then we've come up with the shed. We've got to have a shed for put a dryer in, or we could have a washer dryer fitted into the log, the log cabin, the log. What was it called? In the van. The chateau. The chateau. <laughs> yeah. Chateau. That could be named for it, couldn't it? Yeah. The chateau. <laughs> so that's what we're going to do. Learn <laughs> about the shed for the dryer. The uh, yeah. thing okay. for the. Thing, but at the day you can get a washer dryer, can't you, and sell that one on? So you don't have to keep going out to share. So what we've been doing at the moment is getting rid of stuff. Um, we've had a few things which we've sold now, so it is definitely happening. We're not one of these to say we're doing something and we don't do it. We are doing it. We've put the deposit down on the van and the land, so we've got that sorted. We've got what else are we gonna do now? Just get rid of all this stuff. Yeah. So yeah, I've got rid of my compressor, which can't take that with me. I've got rid of my generator. I can't take that. I could take it with me, but it was a big generator, wasn't it? So that's gone. And now it's there's lamps and things. What we've been just getting rid of and giving out, giving things away and helping other people. But um, it's going to be very very hard to downsize. We're going to have to get a skip for most of some of the stuff what we don't want and believe it or not if we put a skip outside where we live it takes stuff out on it yeah it makes more room though yeah the empty we fill it they empty it then we can get more stuff in it so you what we do is put the good stuff what we think people might take they'll take it then we can fill it back up so we don't hide the good stuff but saying that last time we put a skip outside when we did the flooring it took all the flooring didn't it that were at bottom <laughs> they emptied it so <laughs> Put stuff back in though, didn't they? So it's just a matter now waiting to see uh, if it's sold. So the next video will tell you if it's definitely sold. We've had two offers, which have been good offers, haven't they? Four people's view, two offers, good offers. Update next week. Yeah, update next week. So by this time next week, we'll know. Our journey. Yeah, our journey. But we'll begin. we're going anyway. Well, it is beginning, isn't it, the journey? Yeah. It's going to so be an odd one. Hit that subscribe button, give us a thumbs up, and we'll see you all soon on the next one with our progress. Mm. So bye for now. Bye for now. Mm.